is you made your malfunction. Hey everybody, Goody J here with a second installment of my Serpa holster review. I did the first one, it was about uh, complaints online that I've seen on YouTube about the Serpa holster being inherently unsafe because of the way you draw it. I already covered that in my previous video. I'm not going to cover it again here. Uh, however, so you don't have to go back and look at the other video, I'm just going to recap this for you real quick. As you can see, I have a completely safe, unloaded 9mm Beretta. No magazine. It's in my open carry Serpa holster. The way you draw it, it has a depression lever here. And you use your doggone index finger, your trigger finger. You depress. You don't push. You depress it as you draw up. And every single time I do it, it comes out perfectly safe. Ready to engage the target. That being said, that being recovered, this is the second little gripe that people have about this particular holster. It's being suggested that if you end up in a... Uh, tussle and you're out, down on the ground out and down and out in Beverly Hills or whatever the case may be uh, debris can get inside of here and actually jam up your release guard or your release lever and you won't be able to get the weapon out and so there we are a second concern that I have about something that I've not had a concern about so what I'm going to do is test out the holster with a weapon inside, in the dirt, in debris, and then I'll get back to you to see if it still releases properly. However, while I do enjoy cleaning my weapon after I've fired it, I don't want to clean it when it's perfectly clean as it is. So I have this, my plastic fake, see, no magazine well, no nothing, it's solid plastic, 9mm Beretta in the holster. We're going to test out the holster. See see if I can jam it up so that I can't retrieve my weapon when I need to. We've had uh, quite a bit of rain out here in Georgia lately. And uh, so everything's nice and muddy and muddled up uh, in the backyard. Not that our backyard was ever that great to begin with. I didn't feel like changing clothes and putting on crap that I could roll around in, not to mention I'm 52 years old and I don't need to be rolling around in the dirt unless I actually have to. So let's see. Bam! Oh my gosh! I fell on my side and the perpetrator kept rubbing it back and forth, back and forth in the dirt and rocks and grass. Oh my gosh! Can I still get my weapon out? <gasps> Look at that. Mucked it up pretty good, didn't I? Let's try another one. Oh, I fell over on my side. Oh, and I'm in the leaves and limbs and trees and little rocks and pebbles. Oh my gosh, look how mucked up it is there. Can I get it out? Look. Yeah, but that wasn't that wasn't your full weight coming down on it. You're right. Oh my gosh, they're beating my ass. I've got to get my weapon out. If only I wasn't being rubbed back and forth in the dirt and this perpetrator wasn't just totally kicking my ass. If only I could turn over and retrieve my weapon. Oh, it came straight out. Oh, and it still functions. Uh, uh, what do I do? What do I do? The Serpa is still working. I honestly hope they don't get me down on this dirt because there's little rocks and pebbles every place and that would hurt. I'm telling you, unless you had some padding on your body. I'm not a huge guy, let's face it, you know? And if I go down on this rock, man, we're talking, I'm in pain for years. Oh, but I'm down. Bam! Oh, Perk's got me. He's rubbing me all over the place. I'm getting abrasions. Finally, I turn over. My weapon comes right out again and again. Look how dirty she is. And it still, oh, it still stays in place when it's supposed to. Remember this is fake, it's plastic, okay? Solid plastic. 
I don't want to hear any safety comments from you gurus out there. Yeah, I'm back. I don't have much of a sandy environment out here. However, we do have this nice granulated soil uh, that my wife likes to put plants in that die before the season ever comes around. So it's still dirty. I still haven't cleaned it. But somehow the perp gets me down in the backyard. <laughs> and I'm in the garden area. And he rubs me back and forth. And then I flip over. Oh my gosh, now I got soil up inside of my doggone trousers. You know how much that's pissing me off? I need to get my weapon out. Oh my God, let me try it again. Every time. It still works. Y'all need to stop bitching about stuff when you don't even know what the hell you're bitching about. Thanks to all you experts out there, now I have to clean my circle holster. Huh. That was awfully fast. Well, I gotta clean my fixed pistol too. And later explain why I killed things in my wife's garden. Live it, learn it, love it. Gunny J out. Let me see your war face! That's not a war face! Ah! Give me a war face! Let me see your war face!